Hey everybody, this is Morgan here with Washington Wine and Spirits, bringing you our Spirits of the Week. First up, we have the 10 Cup 10 Year Old Whiskey. 10 Cup Whiskey is a source whiskey out of Colorado uh, made by Jess Graber, who used to be at Stranahan's Distillery out of Colorado. Now Jess is at it again with 10 Cup, and he's showing this beautiful 10 year old expression of this amazing blended whiskey. The mash bill on this whiskey is about two thirds corn, one third rye, and a little bit of malted barley mixed in. It's aged in American white oak barrels for at minimum a decade, and then cut down to 84 proof with fresh Rocky Mountain spring water. On the nose, you get a lot of cinnamon, pine, a little bit of honey, just uh, adds a little touch of sweetness on the nose. And on the palate, you get a lot of, uh, you get a little bit of that sweetness, some pepper, some leather, um, and a little bit of that cinnamon carries over to the palate as well. And on the finish, you get a real nice, just kind of toasted biscuit and uh, almost a little bit of a raisin flavor on it. It just makes for a very, very well-rounded whiskey. Uh, it's very well made, and it's one of our favorites up here at Washington Wine and Spirits. Our next spirit is the Shindig Vodka by Caneland Distillery out of Baton Rouge, Louisiana. This vodka is made a little differently. They actually use sugar cane that's made right here in Louisiana. So you get a little bit of that residual sweetness on the back end along with a lot of vanilla notes. And it's just a great sipping vodka, a great for mixers. It comes in right at 80 proof. It is just a beautiful, clean, crisp, flavorful vodka that I personally really, really enjoy. That's it for our Spirits of the Week. Again, we thank you for shopping with Washington Wine and Spirits. Please go give our Facebook page a like, leave us a comment, check out our YouTube page. Uh, we appreciate everything you guys do for us. And as always, thank you for letting us be your spirits guides here at Washington Wine and Spirits.